Yo, what's going on, man? It's your boy Xavier Page, man. I'm show you my barber setup. You know what I'm saying? 21, live in Kansas City, Missouri. Um, and I ain't really got much to say, man. Just look, just know I'm a new barber. Um, I'm gonna show you guys my setup real quick. Let's get right into it, man. All right, so first thing on this, we're gonna start with tools. Uh, first thing I got is the wall seniors. Um, I had these for about uh, nine months now. So keep in mind, I only been cut for about a year. And I would say I like these clippers a lot. Um, they last me like a very long time. I, you know, I've been using them ever since I bought them. I haven't had no other clipper, but uh, these are my only clippers I have right now. These are, these cost me about like 170, I think, 180 well, well, plus tax. So um, very good clipper. I recommend getting these for your first clipper, highly recommend. Um, never the battery life, like never shut down on me. Um, I feel like I had problems with the way the shape is, like how heavy they are, but other than that, bro, they still run perfectly fine. So, I guess they're kind of a little bit loud, but I guess it's how they are. I don't know if they're supposed to be like that, or supposed to sound like that. So I'll probably have to get a new clipper here soon, but uh, those are from our first. All right, so next thing on the list, we got our trimmers right here. I got two pairs. Uh, I got the Starcraft Flanks. I just got these about a couple months ago. Um, I, I bought these for about $86 on sale for at Macy's. And these are like very good trimmers of hairs. Uh, I never digest them at all. I think I tried to, but I, I'm not able to digest these for some reason. I think it's because like the hardware or some weird issue. I don't know what's going on, but I really like these trimmers. These are hitters, man. Outstanding, you know, clippers or trimmers. I rec highly recommend getting these. It costs uh, full price. I think they're like 140, 150, or something like that. So I highly recommend getting these. These are hitters, man. Next up on this, we got our Gold FX. Uh, I like these trimmers, man. I love them. They're hitters, man. Uh, I accidentally, or I actually dropped these a couple months ago, or about six months, eight months ago. Uh, and I honestly, but these last me for about uh, roughly about nine months. I love them. You know, they, I only had to replace the blade on them. And then, yeah, actually the whole blade. And then I, I did zero gap them, barely. You can kind of see it here a little bit. They're kind of gapped. You can kind of see in the in the uh camera a little bit it's kind of hard to see but you know what i'm saying you can see the tremors you know what i'm saying but these i put the uh, 2.0 blade on here is really good for debulking you know getting to the really you know heavy areas where there's like a lot of hair at you know it's really good getting them into them areas but other otherwise i really love these trimmers i highly recommend getting these and you know you're a new barber they're, they're really you know they're really sharp so be careful when you you know adjust them though. but they work perfectly fine though Next up on the list, we got my full shavers right here. These are uh, my Kumi full shavers. These are like, the, I don't know the name. Like, the, I, think they're, I think they go by Kumi, but uh, Kumi is like kind of like a Chinese brand, but they work really well, man. They're honestly like, you know, the best, I wouldn't say the best, but like the best budget, you know, full shaver you can get. I got these on Amazon for about 30 bucks roughly, and they they never died on me once, bro. Like, I, ha I had not had to charge these one time. And they're still working, which is crazy to me. And um, I would say probably just get like new blades from like new foils, and they'll work perfectly fine. I mean, I have no problem with you know using these. If you're on a budget, I highly recommend going with these, man. Work perfectly fine. So next up on the list, we got our barber bag. Um, basically, I bought this bag from somebody off uh, Facebook, and I got this for about sixty dollars. But you guys can tilt the camera down so you guys can see real quick. But you know, so as you can guys see, it's a really the wall bags really nice bag bro but this bag bro is costing around like i say like if you buy this you know retail from a store full price it'll cost you about a hundred dollars but this bag is probably like i bought it for 60 so uh, it has like two pouches on the side you know what i'm saying got your little pouches in, <clears throat> your pouches in here you put everything here like chargers and stuff like that and pick stuff out you have all your tools and put your stuff on this side or well, i put my clippers on this side because i really can't fit much on this side but i really put you know all my big stuff over here and then basically um got my guards here this is what i use to basically you know cut hair weight you know so i can't i'm not I'm not a pro, I'm not a master barber or whatever you guys call it, you know what I'm saying? But this is where I, you know, use on my guards to, you know, as you can see. Um, got my gloves here, level three, gotta have them. These, you know what I'm saying, really nice gloves, are comfortable. Very grippy for barbers, you know what I'm saying? Very grippy, you know, very, very grippy gloves. I highly recommend getting these today. Over any other glove, get the level three, bro. Highly recommend. 
Got my hair dryer. This is a uh, this is a wall dryer. <clears throat> five, actually, yeah. This is the wall one. It's a five star. So like, this is the the old the old antique one that they you know used to make back then. I think they made them in black, but I guess they started making the silver now. But I bought this from Ross, uh, like the the yeah basically the clothing store, bro. You can get these at like any any hair store really. But I got this for dirt cheap, bro, like twenty bucks. You know what I'm saying? This goes for like fifty or sixty dollar hair dryer. So highly recommend. It has like multiple settings on it, as you guys can see. You know, got the uh, up down. You know what I'm saying? You, you know what I'm saying? You got hella settings. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You dig it. You know what I'm saying? It's a, I highly recommend get this wall dryer, you know what I'm saying, if you have the bread. Got the shaving cream so I can lay the hair down, you know what I'm saying, get the skin nice and clean for the hot towels. So basically when this bag flips over like this, this is basically where I keep all my big stuff like brushes. Um, I keep my brushes in here so the brushes don't get dirty again. I keep them over here because I feel like they'll get dirty sometimes. But um, I also keep my, like, a couple cones over here, uh, some shears, gotta have the shears. I do do shear work, but um, I don't really do, like, a lot of shear cuts, so I just keep them just in case. So, um, got some shears, and I got, the, uh, I got a, a clipper cone, you know what I'm saying? Do some clipper, clipper cone work, and then, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Yep. So, yeah. Yep, so that's it for the barber bag. And then basically we're gonna get into the products and what I use to, you know, you know, what, what gives all the haircuts, what all gives all the crispy all the crispy lines and the crispy fades and the blurry blends. This is what does it all, man. So basically you gotta have clipper side, clipper spray, some type of you know clipper, you know, clipper side to spray your clippers with. And this is what I use. I'm on a budget, so I use a clipper side spray, you know what I'm saying? Gotta have it. Um, and then basically we already went over the shaving gel, so I use the, you know shave hair with, you know what I'm saying, shave, you know. And then basically clip roll, I use the oil my clippers with to make sure they're running good. And then spray bottle, just so, you know, spray spray water, put water in here only. Sometimes I use conditioner, but that's for certain occasions. So, uh, got my hair spray right here, this is level three. Gotta have it, I love this spray. That's why I use to hold the hair in place with. And then, uh, basically, this is my enhancements. Right here, I got one and two. This is jet black and this is darkest brown. Uh, I don't really like uh, I don't really like darkest brown because I feel like it comes out too yeah it comes out too brown to me. I don't know why. But uh jet black is what I usually what I usually use for like more darker hair textures and stuff like that. But these are enhancements, these are spray on so they do leave on I'll say they probably spray on and leave on for about three days. So um, highly recommend using these enhancements. Temptations they go crazy. Um, yeah, those are the enhancements. And then maybe I got some barber side where I use to fill my jar up with, and then we'll go over that to all the end of the video. But uh, some backup shaving, some JV gel, or uh, some aftershave, and then basically some more shaving gel, some backup, and then I got some level three slime gel, so I use the style hair with. So basically, uh, anytime like a client. They basically have straight hair and they want to style it. It's basically what I use to style the hair with. And they, you know, the, the clients, some of the clients love it, but I have some clients that don't really like using it because I feel like it's too strong for them. So um, I basically just use water, do it naturally. So um, what else I got here? Got some, uh, you know, some more hairspray, some uh, got to be glued. Uh, I stopped using this because it's too strong for the hair or for some hair texture. So. Um, yeah, I just like to use the level three better. You know what I'm saying? It comes out, comes out more crispy, uh, so it's cleaner. But uh, got some alcohol here, 99%. Um, got it, you know what I'm saying? Just to have it, just in case. And got some more alcohol. This is 91. Um, I love using 91, but 99 for like you know, gets the cleanse, the skin nice and clean. So, I got some uh, more aftershave or not? Yeah, aftershave right here. This is level three too. But uh, I had this like my whole entire, you know, barber career, man. So if you guys are in the KC area, you guys need a haircut, man, just let me know. Cause I know there's people out there living in KC, man, watching this video. So shout out to you, man. Hit me up. Hit me up on IG. Um, let's see what else I got out here. Yeah, that's pretty much it, though. I did. I think I did go over the shaving gel, or not the shit, the shaving cream. So yeah, but I'm pretty sure that's pretty much it. Though. Oh yeah, I got some uh, olive oil here to, you know, make sure you know, the client gets the, uh, 
gets the, their skin nice and clean, their you know, hair nice and laid, clean, stuff like that. So, uh, yeah. So basically, uh, I do have neck strips right here. Uh, these are like, I don't know how many neck strips I use, but this is what I use to, you know, you know, you gotta have the neck strips, you know what I'm saying? Gotta, gotta have them, bro. Gotta, gotta have them. But, uh, that's what I use to charge my clippers with, you know what I'm saying? Uh, some basic clipper chargers, you know what I'm saying? Raw all you know what I'm saying? And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, though. Uh, Yes, sir. So my sub is in the basement as we speak. So basically, this is my ring light right here. It's about 30, 35, 30 or 35 inches. I uh, bought it from Best Buy. And honestly, I love this ring light. It's my second ring light I ever bought. And it cost me around $90 plus tax of like around $95 to get this uh, ring light. And man, don't, oh yeah, excuse the mannequin in the background, you know what I'm saying? I'm in barber school and I tear that mannequin up, you know what I'm saying? We're not going to talk about that, but uh, yeah. So uh, basically, I uh, love this ring light, you know what I'm saying? It has like one, two settings on it. It has, uh, it's not an LED one, so it has this one, regular, regular setting, and it has the more vibrant setting, you know what I'm saying? So uh, honestly, man, I highly recommend getting you guys one of these if you're a new barber. It helps the, you know what I'm saying? Your cuts out a lot, you know what I'm saying? It helps the... You know what I'm saying? You get to see good quality in your cuts, you know what I'm saying? Detailed work and everything, bro. So I highly recommend y'all get a, you know what I'm saying, a ring light in your setup, 100%. Last but not least, this is my barber chair right here. So basically, uh, I was gifted this to me for my first, 21st birthday. Uh, I appreciate, you know, my parents, for me, my parents for giving me this gift, you know what I'm saying? Uh, can't go wrong for, you know, a 21st birthday coming up barber for for them to gift, gift you a chair. That's, that's amazing, man. So. I appreciate, you know what I'm saying, my parents for giving me this barber chair, but you know what I'm saying, that's pretty much it on the setup though. Yes sir, so comment if you made it this far in the video, comment Xavier Fades 1. Xavier Fades 1 if you guys made it this far in the video, but um, I ain't got too much to say guys, but I appreciate you guys for tuning this far into the video. And um, basically, let me know if you guys want more videos like this in the comments down below, and I'll keep dropping them every day, you know what I'm saying, bangers, you know, any, any haircut tutorials, let me know, man, it could be anything, honestly, haircut vlogs, barber vlogs, barber school vlogs, anything, because um, I currently am in barber school right now, I've been there for about a year now, so or over a year, so basically around, about, I say about around 13, 14 months, so um, I should be about, gra about graduated right now, so i say probably in the next two to three months I'll be graduated. We'll see how, you know, life goes and where bar my barber journey goes, where my career goes right now. So uh, basically follow me for more and uh, I'll keep dropping, you know, videos every week or every Monday or every Friday. Just let me know what you guys want to see, guys, in the future. So I appreciate you guys tuning in this video and uh, deuces.